Welcome back to Lowbrow Gaming and another episode of Return of the Oberdin. So, we're not missing uh, much now. What are we missing though? Let's see, we have the end we have solved. Escape we have solved. There we go, part four. The bargain is locked off, so that doesn't really count right now. I think that's the... Um, the part that is grayed out on the overview. Here we go. Here we go. Uh, met an unknown fate. And who is this? What fate befell them? So, they disappeared during the doom. These guys all fell overboard. He was drowned by a terrible beast. I guess we need to revisit the doom for, uh, for these two. What's our third... This one as well from the Doom. This unknown seaman was blasted with a cannon by Abram Akbar. So, unknown, who are you? Let's see who you are. You're the bald guy. You are wearing this weird little apron thing. Uh, who are you? Who are you? There you are. So you are also part of the gambling crew. Top man. Top man. Top man. Uh, it would reasonably be logical that you are also a top man. However, the only top man left are Chinese. And I... Forgive me if I'm wrong, but he doesn't look particularly Chinese. So let's say... That he's John Naples. <laughs> For example. Uh, <laughs> I don't know what I was expecting right there. Um, right, the others. There we go. Uh, Whaley. Why do we think he's a top man? Just to say. We uh, need to revisit the Doom. I don't think that's going to be it. Uh, but if we go over here, I think our best entryway to at least the part of the doom that I think we need to look at is the uh, the artist over here. So let's have a look at the doom. Part one, I think? Two. Okay. Close enough. All right. You, we have been able to identify as Paul Moss. Let's see, people who are still alive. 43. Yeah, look at the manifest. Maybe go through all of these numbers. 43 is still alive at this point. 43 is Marbai, right? 44 is Lewis Walker. And this is uh, Omid. 48 is missing. 49 is missing. Let's see, 48. Nathan. 49 is Lars. Let's see, these two we have also been able to... Oh wait, this is still an assumption, right? Uh, yeah, this is our bold man. Who's hanging out with... This top man, who we also have not been able to confirm what happened to. Unknown fate. Alright. So he's not currently up in the in the masts. Um we can, however, figure out which one of these two is number 41. Top man. 41. Oh yeah, we've assumed that this is Whaley. I'm assuming this is Whaley. Pretty sure this is Whaley. Um, I doubt this is Whaley. Anyway, no number tag. Oh, but we can return here at a different time when the hammock is reattached. You just have to remember which one. So it's not Omids. So 36, neighboring 36 and 41. 
Okay. That's this hammock. So if we look at what's next to 41 at a different time, we are going to figure out who this bald guy is. Should probably just do that immediately before I forget. So we need to move a bit forward in time to see what happens to Whaley at least. You know what? Let's let's just return to uh, to real time and see if the numbers are still there. So let's just go back in here and just have a look. Whether the hammocks are there? No, they're not. It's just chaos. Just chaos, because this is where it should be, right? Alright. That didn't help us much. It's raining now. Storm's coming. I still think I have all the time in the world, though. Don't you think? Alright. Um, what am I looking for? Um, what am I looking for? Uh, how else can we approach the doom? This one? Yeah. Thomas, trying to save Pete. That's Pete, right? Peter Melroy, yes. Not seeing Wei Li anywhere around here. Right. Anyone hiding around here? Nope. This is the Doom again. A bit later, 12 others were present. Okay, where's Whaley? 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 Also, can we go down below? I don't think we can. Whaley? Whaley? No. There's no Whaley. And there's no Whaley. There he is. Whaley met an unknown fate. Okay, but we are at part 7 out of 8. So, moments after this, Whaley, I think, will perish. Disappeared in the doom, yes. So we need to jump just one step forward from here to figure out what happens to Whaley. Terry is. The doom. Here we go. Uh, ah, Abigail. That's the last part of the doom. She's uh, the key she's been the key to several of these. One of the first bodies we ever saw. So we know exactly where she is. Okay. Whaley. Whaley, where are you? That's the helmsman. This is Whaley, right? No, it isn't. Here's our unknown dude again. Yeah, this is where he disappears. He gets his arm torn off. Where is Whaley? He's already disappeared here. Alright, let's see if we can... Oh, we can't get up there. You are not Whaley. You are not Whaley. Where did he go? See in someone's clutches here. This might be wailing. There he is. He gets pulled down, so. He. I'll say he got drowned. Bye. Beast. 
And if that's not right, then he fell overboard. But he definitely got grabbed by the beast right here. This guy, though... I mean, he might still be alive for all we know, but this is the last we've seen of him. So, let's say that he also gets drowned by the beast. As for who he, as for who he is, he might be George Shirley. Or he might be John Naples. Difficult to tell. See, he's not the same bald man we've seen before. Uh, is that this guy? No. Who's the other guy who disappears? Let's see. Disappeared in the doom. That is you and you. I think you. I think this is accurate. Not sure about this. It could also just have. Oh, not exploded. Fell. Overboard. No? Then we'll say drowned by beast, and hopefully that's correct. Well, uh, let's also change his name. George. Uh, fell. Overboard. Well, worth a shot. Okay. Um, 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 um. Was that the only two from the Doom that we were missing? Maybe. No, we're missing the Frenchman and this guy. Okay. Unknown soul. Oh yeah, this is number 41. No, the, the guy next to 41. Well, let's have a look at the manifests or at the numbers. 41 is Oily. And there's a huge gap for the next one. So, and the other one's Chinese, though. Hmm. All right. Well, I think we're going to have to try to find that number manually, because uh, I get a little bit tired of speculation. But here we go. Ozan's mate. So this is not Charles Minor, then, I guess. He could be the ship's steward. And this guy is one of the top men. This one, for example. All right. Um, unknown soul. Did you be the bosun's mate? Nope. Could you be... George Shirley? Tried that already, didn't we? Could you be... Yeah, you're not that guy. Could you be the ship's steward? No, not likely. I think you are one of these other ones. John Naples, for example. There we go. Three more fates correct. I mean, it is a bit, <laughs> a little bit disappointing that it's just guesswork at this point, but then again, that's, it is a mechanic of the game. There we go, Whaley. Sweet. Next time we figure out who the last three are, and then we look at the bargain chapter. So, in the meantime, thank you so much for watching, and subscribe, click the bell icon, leave comments below, follow us on Twitter and on Discord, you'll find links under the video, and I'll see you next week.